get out. We've got work to do. You're gonna help me get Victor. So today, it's just a start. You play it cool for a week or so, you get right in there. As soon as he starts talking, you get it on tape. And it's great this, because Victor must trust you already. That's why he's offered you the job in the first place. Well, because I'm the only one left. <laughs> Juliet, Jordan, Charlie, Sid, they're all gone. Anything starts to feel wrong or sus, you get straight out of there. Why do you care? You should hate me after what I did to Sid. Well, you messed up. That's what addicts do. I should know. All you care about is where you're getting your next fix from. I even... put my own kids on the line. They're not dead though, are they? Yeah, well, I guess I was lucky. When you're coming off drugs, the first few days are hell. You can't eat. You can't sleep. And the anxiety. Well, the anxiety is that that messes you up. Tell me about it. Are you sure that you're okay with this? Because you have to have a straight head, Ollie. Which means no cat. Don't have a choice. This is for Sid. Good. Because all it will take is even one mistake, and I'd be burying you too. What about? And you're on time. It's a good start. So, I'm hoping that you're here to lighten my load. I don't have time to be running the streets doing footman work. I'm in. I'll do whatever you want. That's what Sid said. And Juliet. And Charlie, but where are they now? I'm sure you're up for this. Because I'll be honest. I've seen better looking roadkill. I'm fine. Just a bit knackered. Is that the stuff? Yeah. Got a guy come to pick this up at 1.30. What we got to do is handle the delivery, bring me the cash. No problem. Good. Please don't want to end up like Sid now, do you? Ollie's staying here after. Well, it's only a few days, isn't it? Till he gets himself straight. I oh, so wanted to help him get clean. I would have gone to meetings with him. I sat with him through the night. It was getting worse. Trying to rob from James was one thing, but Sid, I mean, that boy's dead because of him. I know. But it's Victor that we should be mad at. If you just give Ollie some time, I think he might find his own way out of this. He's doing a pretty bad job of it. Honestly, I don't know how to help him anymore. Which is why it's easier for him to be here so he can just focus on sorting himself out. I think that he is. He'll be all right. Promise me, stay. Promise me you'll keep him safe. Not 
was something. I had a feeling you wouldn't cut it, so I sorted the deal myself. You were here? I was watching you the whole time. You didn't think I'd trust a pathetic little druggie on his first run, did you? Victor. Not interested. You messed up. I can't have that. So I hope you enjoyed that little nap of yours, because now you're going to pay for it. Thank <laughs> you.